This will be set up for the Fire TV Cube, which is located right there. I currently just have the HDMI cable plugged into the back of it. All right, we have supplied it with power. You could see it's flashing on. Might be a little difficult to see, but uh, the cube itself is blue now. And then I swapped over to the HDMI channel that has the fire plugged into it now. And it wants us to press the start button or the play button on the remote. After which I'm going to use the selection or the okay in the middle for English. And because this isn't the first fire device that I've had, my network picked it up automatically. Right there it is showing my name. So who is this going to be for? And we're just gonna select yes, it's for me. And because I reviewed at one time the Fire Stick over there, I can restore those settings to this new Fire device. So I'm gonna say yes, restore. I would like to see what that is. And there it goes, Brian's Fire TV Stick. We're gonna select yes, and it's gonna restore. So parental controls, this is a big thing that I've thought about more recently with some streaming services and streaming devices. I do not have children in my house, so I'm going to select no parental controls. I can select some streaming services, so let's hit get started. We'll add a couple, I'll do Apple TV, Paramount, Paramount. Do I have any cable stuff? I do not. Do I have any sports packages? I do not. Which featured services would you like? Well, yeah, we'll add Tubi and that's it. And we're gonna hit the play pause to continue. Following will be added to the home screen. I will select finish and we can enable the Alex A control on our device. So we're gonna say, sure, continue and selecting next. I do use a sound bar, you can see it right there. That's the Sonos Arc, right there. All right, so they're gonna turn it on and off. Turning your TV off. This may take a minute, please wait. So it says turning your TV off, please wait. And it did. Press fast forward on your Fire TV oh. Cube remote. Turning your TV back on. Fast forward, take a minute. fast forward, not play pause. I was hitting the wrong button, that was on me. And there we go, TV's turning back on. And we're back, can now turn on and off the TV. Gonna hit next. During the next step, it'll play some music, so it's gonna try and do the sound bar. Yes, it muted. So, did not need the optical extender. I was just being impatient and not reading correctly. FireCube is all set up. And there we're brought to our, our screen. So, let's test. Alexa, cancel. Alexa. Turn off my TV. Nice.